ICT here, and today I am going to review the Stealth Arms Platypus. As you can see in my YouTube channel, I have done one 1911, and I didn't have very glowing reviews. The Platypus is a custom built, custom designed, custom paint job, double stack 1911. I went with the tactical style and full length dust cover and in the government size 1911. I also selected the chain link pattern and the fiber optic front sight. For my slide, I went with the Holosun 407K cut. I also got the Ambi Safety, the Mag Funnel. I went with just the standard trigger and I ordered it on April 16th. Let's just say I'm impressed. The ergonomics were awesome. I didn't fumble trying to reload. The mag release was in the perfect spot and the perfect size for my hand. The slide lock was easy to operate. The trigger was crisp, a little bit more take up than I was expecting, and the reset was also longer than expected. For this first range trip with the platypus, I only took about 200 rounds with me. And no, none of these manufacturers are sponsoring me, but I used the Federal Syntec, the IWI defensive rounds, the Winchester 115 grain white box, and I had no malfunctions. And since it takes Glock mags, I decided to try out all my different mags. Everything from the Sentry Hex mag to the P mags, KCI, ETS, everything just ran flawless. Even the Hex mag, which some of the other guns don't like to run, ran flawlessly. Some pros and cons of this platypus. It's definitely highly customizable. It takes Glock mags, which are cheap, readily available, and in about every color and size that you could want. It feels great in your hand. The ergonomics are great. Like I said before, I didn't have any problems operating the gun while at the range. And the order process was smooth, and they had a cute little order tracker. Cons that I have come up with you is that the slide doesn't have or use adapter plates. You're stuck with whatever cut you have. Luckily, in today's market, there are plenty of options for each footprint. Wait time. At the time of this recording, it was going on 14 weeks plus before you would actually get one. Something that I did notice, actually the guy at the FFL noticed, was that the frame, dust cover, grips, everything on that bottom half was cut from one chunk of aluminum. So if you ding one bit, you're kind of out of luck. Overall, it's a great gun if you can afford it. It's not one of the cheapest out there, but it is definitely cheaper than a staccato. It's nice that the mags and ammo are plentiful and relatively cheap. I would highly recommend a platypus to anyone who is uh, looking for a double stack 1911 that takes Glock mags. Have you ever shot one? What's your take on this double stack 1911 that takes Glock mags? Let me know in the comments below.